Hi guys, today I will show you why sweet port is becoming into elder disable port state. And as you know, elder disable port state is a feature that automatically disable a port on the Cisco Catalyst Switch. When a port is elder disabled, it effectively shut down and no traffic is sent or received on the port. And the reason that match sweet port is becoming into error disabled state there are many reasons like when a double mismatch is also caused the sweet port is becoming to error disabled state loopback errors link flapping port security violation unica flooding you need directional link detection failure broadcast storm BPD you got all this reason that can make sweet port become into error disabled state and when a port is in error disabled state it is effectively shut down and no traffic is sent or received on the port the port is set into orange color and when you issue the show interface command the port status so as the error disabled there are two ways to recover that port when it's become into uh, error disabled state. First, we need to manual, and second, we can use uh, auto recovery feature. But in this video, I will show you how to manual that port. As in Tech Tech Search, it's not support auto recovery and auto recovery feature I will show you in next video so let's go to my testing labs in this lab I will set the switch into port security violation as when I set into port security violation when the matters are learning to the another rise Mattress when it's learning to the ports that are not allowed, it will shut down that port or it make that port into error disabled state. So in this lab, I use port security violation. So in this lab, there are three PC: PC0, PC2, and PC1. PC0, I use it as the authorized PC. It means that this mattress is allowed to learn through port 5 robot one when another smart address is learned through this port it will make this port into error disabled state so I use PC0 and PC2 and PC0 as the authorized PC with this smart address and PC2 is an authorized PC when PC2 is connected into port 5 robot one it will make this port in to eligible state so I need to configure it at the speed post violation Extreme one. Wait, I use it as a sticky mode. You can use any VLAN that you want, but in my testing, I use VLAN too. Okay. So. 
You get plus 60 and the balls. Well, it isn't set down. We okay, first let it register that matrix in that port. Okay, now DC matrix DC HH from the Australia PC already register into port 5 in as row bar 1. So when the Australia PC with this matrix and connect to this port, it will be coming to uh, error disable state. First, disable that port. Okay, so that's what is app. Yes, so I deconnect it from the outside PC and put it, plug it with another IPC. Let's see. Okay, you see, port is going to set down step. So let's see. Okay. Port is becoming to error disable state. Here you see, it's set down at port and port is becoming to error disable state. Like in this point, the error disable feature was designed to inform the administrator when there is a port problem or error. The reason of the catalyst switch can go into error disable state and shut down a port and many includes the below. Yes, so in here, I use this feature to make this port into error disable set. Yes. Sometimes when uh, your your link is flapping in also port becoming to error disable state also. So when we want to make this port back, we need to go into that port and use the command the command set down and no set you can see yes but if you still use the anasrai pc this port it will still shut down it will become the shutdown again like in this point as i said that to recover a port that is in air reservoir state menu intervention is required and the administrator must access the switch port and use the follow command by shut down and no shut command the command sequence will be an ball port again. However, if the problem persists, expect to find port in error disable state again soon. So, when we go into that port by using SAT and no SAT, we need to replug the port back. Otherwise, although you put the the IPC back, the port still shut down. So, you can see the port is up. Yeah, successful. Yes. So, this is the way that port is becoming to error disable state. And the reason that makes that port become into error disable state is, I, I mentioned in this. Thank you for watching this video. For next video, I will show you about uh, auto recovery. It means it, when it's becoming to uh, error disable state, it will recover by its own. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe my channel and you will get new video from me. Thank you so much.